Hey y'all, and welcome back to Successful Six. So today we have a great video for you all because it's our monthly grocery haul from Walmart. So let's jump right into it. Starting over here, we have two big containers of canola oil. We have a um, tomato ketchup bottle. And we have three bottles of garlic powder, which is one of my favorite seasonings. We have some basil leaves. We have two containers of the cinnamon rolls with icing because we're going to try the viral cinnamon roll hack. We also picked up some heavy whipping cream, which we'll use in that hack. Then we got four bottles of Sam's Cola, which is the Walmart brand of Coca-Cola. And it's really, really wonderful. So if you haven't tried it yet, go ahead and give it a try. We have a Cracker Barrel cheese, as well as two containers of French onion dip. We have low sodium soy sauce, rice vinegar, as well as Texas peat. And we'll use that for different cooking applications that we need. We have some vegan cheese um, for those who are lactose intolerant who still love cheese. As well as various shredded cheeses. We have mozzarella, we have cheddar. We have provolone and mozzarella, and then we have some mozzarella in the back that we'll probably use for pizzas and different sandwiches and soups. Then we have some Havarti cheese, as well as some sliced pepper jack cheese, which is wonderful with the creaminess from the cheese and the spice from the peppers. Then we have five containers of chicken pop stickers, as well as a bag of pork pop stickers, and we'll use this for um, this week's... Um, Chinese meal. We're going to make homemade Chinese uh, Friday night, so we'll go ahead and do that. And then we have sour cream. Two containers of Daisy sour cream. We have a few packages of thin spaghetti. It's always nice to have some dry pasta in the pantry. Then we have some pancetta as well as spring roll wrappers. And then we have some butter, various deli meats in the back. And then finally all the way in the back we have a pork um, pork roast then we have wonton wrappers again we'll use this for our homemade Chinese food we have a box of burgers pre-made burger patties and this is just makes it easy to throw them on the grill or throw them in the skillet for a quick burger we have a 12 pack of beef flavor ramen noodles as well as two boxes of the chicken flavor ramen noodles for a quick lunch or snack. We have two bottles of pizza sauce as well as a few boxes of the cauliflower pizza crust as this makes for a wonderful and light pizza and it's a healthier but not exactly healthy alternative to pizza when you craving pizza. And then we have white Snickers as well as mint Kit Kat, just anybody who having a sweet tooth and is craving some candy. Then we have Italian style meatballs as well as home style meatballs for um, some quick protein to throw in with the spaghetti noodles. Or if you just want to make some barbecue meatballs, you can do that as well. Then we have P.S. Chang's sweet chili sauce. Again, we'll use this for our Chinese food. We have angel hair half length um, pasta. And again, this was a well, this was a substitute, but we'll make use with this. And then we have various breads. We have Bulios bread, which is like a football shaped bread. And then we have ciabatta bread, which will be wonderful. Some artesian sandwiches that we'll make. Down here we have some imitation crab, and we'll use this to make crab ragoons um, or crab wontons for the Chinese food we're making. We have the seasoned sirloin Philly steak. Um, by Walmart and this is wonderful it comes together really quickly and makes for a delicious um, Philly steak and cheese we have fresh ground turkey that we'll use for our taco nights and then we have some meats underneath that we have two large bags of chiboneless skinless chicken breast and this comes in handy when you want to make some homemade chicken nuggets if you want to make a chicken soup or if you even want to make chicken tenders it's just lovely to have chicken breast on hand then we have some steak 
And again, we'll use this um, for the steak and broccoli that we're going to have for our Chinese food night. And then we have some pork, some ground pork next to that. We have some salt, salted pork. And then we have 16 um, ballpark hot dogs. Next, we're coming to our produce. We have some romaine, hearts of romaine lettuce. We have two packages of our fresh spinach. We love to put this in salads and in soups. It's just wonderful to have. And then we have our shredded iceberg lettuce, as well as um, some coleslaw mix. And finally, for the produce, we have some tomatoes that we just like to throw in salads or throw on top of sandwiches. And finally, we have ground beef um, that we use for our pastas. And if we do make homemade hamburgers, we will use that. We have better than bouillon seasoning. We have a few packages of taco seasoning. It just makes taco night a lot easy. And then we have whole milk. We have various slumped in onion soup mixes. We have onion and mushroom. We have beefy onion. And then we have just the onion soup mix. And then we have two packages of Kobe Jack cheese. And then we have some stacks. We have salt and vinegar, as well as the buffalo and ranch. And that will be a new flavor we'll try. And to round out this large haul, we have a six count of wheat sub rolls. So I hope you all enjoyed this mega haul from Walmart. I hope it inspires you to get something good to eat and make it for your family or friends or just eat with your family and friends. And thanks for being around. See you in the next one. And don't forget to like, share, comment, subscribe. Bye-bye now.